turmoil, tragedy, and troubling vaccination views. Nothing screams drama like a Kennedy's love life. But what do we really know about RFK Jr.'s rocky relationship history? Robert F. Kennedy Jr. is an environmental lawyer and author who comes from a long line of influential political figures. RFK Jr. has spent his career attempting to fill the big shoes left behind by his father, Robert F. Kennedy, and uncle, John F. Kennedy. The self-proclaimed truth-teller, who recently announced his run for president, is well known for his controversial views on vaccines, which may overshadow coverage of his presidential run. After comparing COVID vaccine restrictions to the struggles that Anne Frank endured during the Holocaust, some of Kennedy's family members have withdrawn their support. For example, his sister Carrie Kennedy tweeted her own condemnation of what she called RFK Jr.'s hateful rhetoric. And these comments even got him into hot water at home. His current wife, Cheryl Hines, spoke out against these views, tweeting, My husband's opinions are not a reflection of my own. While we love each other, we differ on many current issues. As a thrice-married man, RFK Jr. is no stranger to conflict. With the announcement of his presidential bid, it might be worth getting to know the storied past of Kennedy's relationships. RFK Jr. met his first wife, Emily Black, during his time attending law school at the University of Virginia. The two were married on April 3, 1982, in a beautiful church ceremony fit for one of the most prominent political families in America. Sadly, RFK Jr. divorced Emily in 1994. They had been together for 12 years and brought two children into the world, Kathleen and Robert III. According to the LA Times, Kennedy said he had fallen deeply in love with his soon-to-be second wife, Mary, while he was gearing up for his first divorce. Robert F. Kennedy's relationship with his second wife, Mary Richardson, got off to a fairy tale start. Richardson was a close friend of RFK Jr.'s sister, Carrie, who said of their relationship, I have never seen two people more thoroughly enchanted with one another and more completely in love. The marriage, however, did not last. After 16 years of marriage and four children together, RFK Jr. and Mary began the process of getting divorced. The proceedings quickly became messy and painful, and Mary Richardson died by suicide before the divorce was finalized. RFK Jr. may have been aware of her suicidal tendencies, claiming in an extensive affidavit that she had made threats to her own life in front of their children. Even still, it was reported by Newsweek that he wept upon hearing the news of her death. Robert F. Kennedy Jr.'s current wife, Cheryl Hines, is an actress and director known for her role in Curb Your Enthusiasm. In fact, it was reported by People magazine that show creator Larry David is to thank for the couple's romance. Pretty good! Pretty, pretty good. Hines is a graduate of the University of Central Florida. She and Kennedy eventually started dating after two separate introductions courtesy of David. RFK Jr. later shared with the New York Times that he was in the thick of his second divorce when he met Hines, who had recently filed for divorce herself. The two have publicly shared their love for each other many times throughout their relationship, often openly enjoying each other's humor and thoughtfulness. Hines and Kennedy were married in a casual ceremony in Hyannis Port, Massachusetts after two years of dating. While most are aware that the couple does not see eye to eye on everything, especially their political views, Hines has continued to stand by her husband's side. After announcing his 2024 presidential bid, she released a statement claiming that she is in full support of her husband's decision. She said, he is a fearless leader who understands the needs of the American people and has devoted his life fighting for democracy. If you or anyone you know is having suicidal thoughts, please call the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline by dialing 988 or by calling 1-800-273-TALK-8255.